Hi everybody, this is your girl Tanisha Pinesize Diva and welcome to Keeping It 100, the web series. I have a rant of the week. So, as I saw when I was watching The Real over the summer, they had this thing called Rant of the Week. So, instead of doing Throwback Thursday, I'm going to do Rant Thursday because it's some shit I need to get off my chest. FYI, if you are not at least 18 years or older, please get off my damn YouTube series. I don't want to have the sense of this. I'm going to say how I feel. And if you don't like it, you know what you can do? You can kiss half of all my ass. Okay? Because at the end of the day, you have an opinion. I have an opinion. But that's what freedom of speech is for. Let's get into it. Rant number one. You know what irritates me? Hmm. What irritates me is that, you know, I'm, I'm a thick girl. Yeah. And it's a lot of thick girls in this world. What's up talking about plus size sisters? Whoop, whoop. Okay. So what I don't understand is you cannot meet somebody one way and then expect them to be something else. I mean, seriously, ladies, really? Really? This is my rant. Make sure that if you do anything, you're going to change for you. Don't change for no damn man. Don't change to accommodate no man, woman, whatever you got going on. Don't you change for nobody but you. Because at the end of the day, as soon as you get to making all the necessary changes, doing all those things, he's going to find somebody else that's the opposite of everything he's asked of you. Same thing if you're in a different kind of relationship. Whatever your situation is, don't change for nobody else. You be the best you that you can be. That's my rant number one. Rant number two. What I don't like is that when you go places and people looking at you all upside your head. Don't you hate motherfuckers look upside your head? I personally can't stand it. I know you can't stand it. So this is the best way to keep people off you. When they look at you, shit, look at them back. Because at the end of the day, you have to understand this is your life. You can't press control, alt, delete, and start over and start the taskmaster and begin again and recorrect things. You ain't got but one life. Absolutely one. Ain't no start off, ain't no start over button that you can push and make it right. So you'll be the best you you can be. And if don't nobody like it, in the late in the words of late burning Mac, fuck them. And that's just real. Um, my rant number three. <sighs> I really, really dislike when people don't tell you how they really feel. And what I mean by that is this. You know, everybody has their way of thinking. Everybody has their way of comprehending. And I get that. Everybody is different. Men are completely different from women. And women are completely different than men. But say what you mean and mean what you say. Don't deviate from the plan. I'm one of those people where if you're going, if you're going to tell me something, I'm going to hold you to it. And I'm going to hold you to it deep. And that's just how I am. I don't know what your situation is. It's up to you. But at the end of the day, if you're going to say something, be accountable for that. Don't make excuses for it. Don't go, well, I, 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 I. No. You said it. You meant it. That's just what it is. Because at the end of the day, the only person that's going to judge you is God. So don't nobody else need to be trying to fucking judge you because that's not fair. That's number four, I think. Number five, um, I hate cheap ass men. <sighs> you want some ass, but you think your rendition of a nice dinner on a date is McDonald's or Burger King. I mean, this has not happened to me, but I know a lot of people that it has happened to. And I think that's not cool. I feel like that if you're trying to get to know a person, you should know what you can do and what you cannot do before you leave the house. Let that be established. I'm all about deals and steals. I'm, I'm safety sadly. I like finding a great deal for a little bit of value. But sometimes you have to find a way to, to balance and to splurge and to do what you want to do. And that's just how I feel about it. Uh, that's number five, I think. <laughs> number five. Whole finger. Yay, five. One, two, three, four, five. There it is. Um, rent number six. I hate when people get on social media and they read something and they think the shit is true. My thing is, I'm in the words of Janet Jackson. This song ain't about you. This tweet ain't about you. This Facebook post ain't about you. This Instagram ain't about you. Dude, really? Female, really? Y'all quit taking these fucking posts online so fucking seriously. 
It's so sure. You're supposed to speak your mind. You're not supposed to go, well, I can't put that on there because my man them might see it and they might call me. Fuck you. Fuck them. Fuck whatever they got to say. You post what you want to post because it's your motherfucking page. Don't worry about what nobody going to say about you. If they got to want to have proof, have them call your phone. You got seven digits and with your every code is ten. Dial them motherfuckers and ask questions. I am so tired of people calling and blowing on my phone and direct messaging me. Ask me, ooh, then why are you talking about me? Bitch, you must be guilty. Quit fucking acting like you don't know how to talk. If you got my fucking phone number... And you want to ask me on social media what I'm talking about? You a weak ass bitch. And you wish you go to hell with gasoline, draws on, skate down the street, eat some ice cream with a t-shirt, walking around with a bowl of cereal with no milk. I'm just saying. I hate that bullshit. And I know a lot of celebrities go through it. And I'm not a celebrity. And I know I would never get to that status. But I hate when people post shit online and... Folks all of a sudden want to inbox you and call you and talk to you. What's wrong? Or did you say that about me? Or, oh my God, I can't believe you posted. Last time I checked, you have freedom of speech. You can say whatever the fuck you want to say without no recourse. Long as you ain't talking about hurting nobody, brutalizing nobody, or doing nothing negative, you can say what you want to say because it's your mouth and you can say what you want to say. And on that, I am through. This is your girl, Tanisha Pine Size Diva, and that's what's up. I hope you enjoyed this rant. If you have rants that you want to get off your chest and you want to express them on my YouTube series, feel free. Hit me up on Twitter at thickness 1010 If you want to follow me on Instagram, it is plus size model 16. Yeah, it's plus size model 16. Yeah. If it's not that, I put it at the end of the screen. Um, like I said, follow me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter, follow me on Instagram. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, hateration, whatever you got to do, because your opinion does matter, and I take that into account. You can hit me up at plusmodeltjackson at gmail.com. That's plusmodeltjackson at gmail.com. Part two um, is coming in a few minutes, so I hope you enjoy this. Like I said... Rant your ass off. Why? Because it's your mouth and you can say what you want to say. Holla. Bye.